Hey friends, this is David with Tubo Biz, and I want to welcome you back to the Tubo Biz channel. Friends, today I am going to tell you, first of all, I appreciate all the questions we get. We're getting over a hundred inquiries a day right now, and we're getting questions all the time. And friends, I just need to get this off my shoulders because there are questions that drive me crazy because they're so hard to answer and they're asked over and over again. So here is three questions that will let you know which drives me bonkers. Question number one here is how much sugarcane juice can I get from one kilogram of sugarcane in your machine? Okay, people, they'll say, they'll say to me, David, tell me exactly how much sugarcane juice I can get from one kilogram in your machine. Friends, it's impossible to answer that because sugarcane is not the same all around the world. It depends on the variety, it depends on the time of year, it depends on how long from when the sugarcane is cut to when you put it through the machine. It depends on the machine, on the clearance of the rollers, on the torque, on the motor. And so to answer somebody who says, tell me exactly how much sugarcane I can get, sugarcane juice from your machine, friends, can't do it. I can't answer that, okay? What I can do and what will help you is to give you the average. And then if you know the average, then it will help you plan for your business. And my advice for you is that you take the conservative side, okay? Now, the average with our machines is between 500 ml, one half liter, and 750 ml in a best case scenario, okay? So friends, what I want you to do is to plan on the lower amount, okay? Plan about one half liter per kilogram because doing that, you will have that smile on your face at the end of the day, at the end of the month, when your profit margin is surprisingly high, okay? So go on the conservative figure, all right? It's likely that if the cane is fresh, if it's juicy, especially if it's in the tropics and it's in the rainy season, for example, you're gonna get more juice per kilogram, okay? So again, the question, David, please tell me exactly how much hurricane juice your machine can give me per kilogram can't tell you exactly, but between 500 and 750 ml, somewhere in there is a very good window to depend on in making your calculations. And my own advice for your business is to go on the conservative figure, okay? All right, the second question that just drives me absolutely crazy, and CJ help me with this, I have it right here, okay. Question number two. Tell me the cheapest machine that is the highest quality machine that will never break. Ah, there is no such thing as a cheap sugarcane machine that is high quality. Friends, get that straight. Do not be deceived, especially by photos online. Man, the, the really cheap knockoff makers now, they're learning how, like the techniques that we invented, they are learning how to make the machines look really great or Photoshop things that, you know, they, they won't look like that when you get them. And friends, be very, very careful if you're gonna buy off a of photo, because these, these knockoff people, you know, they will write anything. They will write quality sugar cane machine at the lowest price. You know, friends, if you're gonna get quality in something that's gonna last, you're gonna have to pay a certain amount to get that level of quality. That's just how it is, all right? So the, the next question, CJ, what was that? The price comparison that people find online. Friends, people, they'll say, David, I was just looking on Alibaba and I saw the exact same thing as your product and it cost a lot less. Friends, we know the word knockoff. I'm knocking my head because people, they will look at something that looks similar and say, that's the same. Why is yours more expensive, friends? That's what 
knockoff means. That's what copy means. It doesn't mean copy the quality. It doesn't mean copy the level of service that you get. It doesn't mean copy any of that. What it means is make something look like the other or what they do is they steal. They just steal the photo like our photo or use our product numbers and say it's the same thing. Beware friends, beware because it's not the same. All right, get the ones that are gonna really help you out, the ones that are gonna make you successful in your business. All right, friends, so all of your questions are so appreciated by us. Right now, we're getting over 100 questions a day, 100 inquiries a day for our products. And friends, we do appreciate them all. And there is no such thing as a dumb question, but there are certain questions that are not easy to answer that I wanted to address today. And hopefully, it will help you to make your informed decision to get the very best sugarcane machine for you. I want to thank you for watching today. I am David with Tubo Biz. If you've not yet subscribed, click that red subscribe button on our channel and become one of our many subscribers here and we will keep uploading more information to help you out to be successful in your sugarcane business. Thank you for watching.